Hello everyone, this is my full feedback on changing class on Diablo Immortal after three weeks spent on my new class Demon Hunter from the Crusader. I'll tell you everything that you need to know and especially the things that you must at all costs avoid. So a quick reminder that you need to keep in mind if you change your class, I will after give you every detail on this in order to help you. So first you won't have any legendary power so you need to farm them. If you change from strength to intelligence, for example Crusader to wizard, you won't have the right attribute on your item so you need also to farm this one. But you'll be able to keep your set if you wish. You won't have the right legendary gems if you switch from melee character to distance or for example to a summoner necromancer and you lose the skins that you unlocked on your character. Your paragon will also be reset, so just make sure to have the build before changing your class. The first thing and most important one will be to get some legendary powers, and for that you need to have in stock like 1 million, 2 million of golds in order to gamble the 20 equipments, 10 weapons and 10 armors per day. You can also keep for example the battle pass rewards and the events rewards which give sometimes legendary items for your new class. You should not use the hilts because it's a bit overpriced to pay 1600 hilts for a legendary item. For the sets you'll be able to use your previous one. The game also gives you temporary one but it's a bit weird because they don't give any set bonus so you can forget about them and just use the previous one in order to farm the new one. For example if you wish to have a summoning set, a tanky set and so on. For the skins it's also a bit weird because each skin will be linked to your class that means that if you unlock a skin with a particular class, you won't be able to use it on your new class. So when you have this new class, you need to unlock new skin if you wish to have them. Of course, you won't be able to use these new skins with your previous class. For the legendary gems, when I move from my Crusader to my Demon Hunter, of course the gems are not the same. And it's okay since you can use your previous one in order to get the same rank with your new one. With the 1 star gems it's easy to do, with the 2 star gems it's a bit more tricky because you need plenty of the same gems in order to have your previous level of legendary gem. So it will just take some time but you won't lose much changing your legendary gems. For the PvP, if you do the 3 PvP matches a day, you need to do the first one before changing class, then you move to your new class. You'll have some time to do everything that I mentioned in this video and the next day you can go back to PvP. You'll get some gems, legendary powers and so on in order to do your 3 PvP matches in the day. So now if you wish after a few weeks to change your class or go back to your first class, that means that you'll use the changing class system again. I don't speak about the constellation but really to change class one more time. First the good point is that you'll keep your legendary powers so you don't need to farm them again and you keep the skins that you had before changing your class. The thing is that you won't be able to cancel, that means that I just wanted to check back my Crusader and I cannot cancel to go back to my Demon Hunter. So I'll have to be stuck for 7 days in order to go back to my Demon Hunter, so just make sure to not do the same mistake as I did. Maybe with some luck they will fix it, but for now it's not the case. You want to change class only if you are tired of your current class and want to try something else. You won't have any buff and it will take like 2 or 3 weeks to go back on your feet with your new class. You can also consider changing this class if you wish, for example to have a class more orientated on PvE or PvP. Basically, changing class is as if you had a new character from scratch but you keep your level and combat rating. Thanks for watching this video, I hope you have all the information that you needed on changing class. Of course if you have any questions feel free to post in the comments. And I plan to release soon my Demon Hunter build, but since I'm a bit stuck on my Crusader it will be released a bit later next week, bye bye.